Welcome everyone, so I was trying to install iOS 14 on the iPhone SE. Every time I try to install, I get brought to this uh, progress bar, it like starts going and then it just kicks me out. I'm going to show you how to fix that right now. So the issue is, is because you're jailbroken, so we need to unjailbreak. If you have Uncover, follow this tutorial. If you have Checkrain, also follow this tutorial, but later on. You're going to open up Uncover, tap on Settings, find Restore FS, turn that on. And just tap on restore root fs if you randomly get restarted that means it failed but if it says um jailbreak completed or restore root fs completed that means you're good to go now if you have check rain here's what you're going to do you're going to need to re-jailbreak your device and you need to make sure check rain is on the home screen so i'm just going to get all of the cables that i need so i'll plug this in i'll plug it into here and we'll just close out this, tap on OK, and it'll restart our device. So this device is now ready to install iOS 14. It'll probably ask you to reinstall it, just reinstall, and you'll have absolutely no issues. So now I'm going to get my iPhone SE, and I'm going to re jailbreak it with Check Crane. So I'll go to there, and you can see, not the most organized, but I'll plug it in, and then I'll load up Check Crane right here there we go and you can see um check crane will say this will enable untested versions click on ok and next so we need to re jailbreak our device with check crane then we need to un jailbreak our device um i don't think apple intentionally blocked the updates but it is an issue that you will have so let's um put the device into dfu mode so one zero and there we go now, I'd just like to say, I'll be personally updating the iPhone SE and iPhone 10 to iOS 14. If this tutorial doesn't work, it's not going to be uploaded. All right, I'd just like to say. So, if you are seeing this tutorial, then obviously it works. So, I'll just wait for this to reboot and we should be done. The iPhone 10 has also been on jailbroken and so we should be able to update with success. If you on jailbreak or if, even if you are jailbroken, you will still see the update, but um it will not work properly so let's go into check rain so i'm going to turn off wi-fi we'll wait for it to show up on the home screen come on there we go and we're just going to tap on restore system and there we go if it gave you an error code re jailbreak and then try again but now it's going to have a very long boot process and don't worry about it it will work eventually but you just need to keep in mind that you'll probably see the apple logo for like three minutes it's essentially on jailbreaking your device removing all the things it did so don't worry it will finish very soon so um we'll see the apple logo and we should be back to stock ios you'll see sudo's also gone come on and it really is this easy you know i just wanted to make these videos just so your update experience is extremely smooth um and yeah Obviously, I will be testing this. I mean, I know it works because I did it, but I'd like to test it multiple times on both devices. Just make sure that we have a 100% success rate. So again, this is probably taking like a minute. It usually takes like 20, 30 seconds. So that's something to keep in mind. Um, okay. We unlock. City is gone. Check range is gone. And now the update should work successfully. Okay. So we'll go here, and we will need to reinstall the update. It now says iOS 14.0, that's a bug, right? Usually it will say public beta, but we're going to have it installed. I would just like to, if I get one more pop-up asking for my Apple ID, oh my God, I'm just going to switch Wi-Fi and this will work. I'll have another video showing iOS 14 did install successfully in the pinned comment or description. But of course, you know, it does take time to install. So this video will come out first. Hopefully you did enjoy um let's connect to this wi-fi and i'll see you guys in my next ios 14 related tutorial again this is a bug this is also a bug but it will install bye bye